Hi you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Look how beautiful it is in the country. I love the country, you guys. And my petunias are growing. I'm really happy about that. You can always see lots of um, birds and uh, hummingbirds. I just love it out here. But what I want to tell you about today is this is fast forward a few, well, almost a year of me using this product. So I'm just gonna tell you about how it's turned out. <laughs> I just woke up so you can hear it in my voice. I just woke up, I love the country. <laughs> I like so many of you, I am an exfoliation queen. I have used coffee grinds, apricot shells, uh, before I knew better, you know, before we knew better, we do before we know better. I use those plastic microbeads. I know they're terrible for the ocean, so you should never, ever, in my opinion, use those products. I had read a negative review about this body scrub. If this is used all over your body, it's for someone, I would say, with sensitive skin. That's something for them. This is for the hmm, exfoliation princesses. <laughs> Princesses in waiting to become exfoliation queens. Um, you need to be damp, not wet, when you use this. Uh, it disintegrates very quickly if you are fully wet. So just make sure your skin is damp. It's so light and fluffy that it just it disintegrates, right? And I think that's what they were upset about because it just seemed to melt into your skin. Uh, I, what I do is I use a warm face cloth. And then I remove all the water and I spoon a small amount on there, not even a teaspoon amount, onto the face cloth. And then I just do my face with it. I don't do my body with it. It just, it just disintegrates. And I don't find it strong enough, the beads strong enough, to really make me feel like I'm exfoliating, you know? And this kind of salt, I'll look at the back and show you what the salt is, but this kind of salt does its job. It does the cleansing, the scrubbing. It feels like it's going deep into the pores, like seeping into my pores. It just melts into the skin nicely. You rinse and move on with your facial ritual. So I wanna show you here, can you see that? That is sea salt. I believe it's called Marisol. And what that is, it's called sea salt, um, dead sea salt, dead sea minerals. So it's minerals, right, that this salt is. It's really great. And I wanna show you what I usually do. What I usually do is I take about this here, you can see. Right there. And I just take a little bit like that. See? So what this is, is a naturally occurring substance. It is uh, inorganic sea salt derived by seawater. So, you know that I only like, <laughs> I like to use natural products and everything, right? So this mineral is wonderful, and this is just how much I use. See, I'll just put a little on my glove there. It's got a nice oil to it and everything, see? Very, very nice. Very nice product. And that's all you need. See, look how much it just came out, see? That's all you need. Make certain that the cloth is damp, right? Not a lot of water, because if you have a lot of water, it's just gone, right? So, I might put some on my face right now. So they use this product, a lot of really lovely skin products, they use this in conditioning the skin, and it says in the INCI, the, that's the beauty business, business I guess <laughs> it says the purpose of this is for skin conditioning and I can attest it's quite lovely I really like it a lot naturally occurring substance oh, I put some on my face oh oh 
I love it. I also want to say that these are products that I had before the global pandemic happened and so much hardship happened. So these are just products that I had around the house that I'm showing you that I use that I, I like. Um, I haven't, uh, just so that you know, right? It's not me going, look at all these face products, right? I had them around the house. So I'm showing you in case you are, you know what? Some of you might be in your house and you're like, you know what? It's time I start taking care of my face. So <laughs> these videos are for you. Um, oh, this stuff, they say the sea salt can be used in hand care, peeling of the skin. They use it in hand creams, firming day creams. It's wonderful. And I, I'm, this stuff must be like the pure form of it. Look at it. Oh, it's wonderful and so light. Um, oh, I want to tell you this. I don't know if you they do shout outs to companies or whatever, but this is from Lush. I really love it. It's called Coco Loco, as you can see, and you can see what's in it. It's a body spray. I don't use it for that. It's a vegan. This has been watered down. I put lots and lots of water in here. So this has lasted me a long time. So probably there was up to the V, it doesn't even matter. I put so much water in here and water it down because when you get it, it's such a strong, strong fragrance. You only need a little bit of it. So I constantly water it down continuously. I think, I don't even know how long I've had this, but um, I spray it as a room spray and on things that the pets have or whatever. It's a nice scent. And I can even show you over here, Let's see? I just sprayed the cat's blanket. So I took this stuff and I spritz it and then I'm out here with you all happy. This is a really, really great product. They say to use it all over your skin. I gave you my personal opinion of it. It's wonderful. It's wonderful and it smells, guys, it smells like the ocean. Mm, it does. Premium sea salt and oils. Yeah, remember when I had it on my finger there? You saw some oils from it. Ooh, and vitamins. Oh, great. So it's wonderful. I'll use it today. Great. That's my review, you guys. XOXO.